gentlemen, welcome to Son of a Beach. Tonight's guests are Varun Grover and Richa Chadda. Now, give it up for your host, the one and only, Abish Matthew! My name is Abish Matthew and welcome to Son of Abish! Woo! Yes! Uh, we've got a great show lined up for you today. By the way, we've got two amazing guests. We've got Varun Grover and Richa Chadda in the house! Uh, before we actually start, I thought let's take a look at what's happening in the first world. You know, first world issues are what third world people look and say, Gosh. <laughs> People who don't have issues such as hunger and unemployment. Let's see what they are up to in a segment we like to call In Other News. <laughs> All right. In Other News, a British online adult sex shop, Bondara, has come up with a sex Fitbit that rates your performance during sex. <laughs> now, the product might rate you five stars, but in real life, the girl is rating him three Z's. <laughs> it's called the sex fit, guys. And for this, the guy has to wear it on his penis to track how well he's having sex. Now, without the product, I can tell you, he's having it quite well. <laughs> Now, it measures important statistics such as thrust, speed, temperature, your insecurity. <laughs> Who is going to be in the mood for review after sex? Like, what do you expect them to go? They go speed me A plus plus, <laughs> duration me F minus. See, you can do much better if you avoid silly mistakes. But you know what? Neatness clay plus one. <laughs> The interesting thing is that this product syncs with your iPhone and tracks you in real time, telling you if you're going a little too fast or if you're going a little too slow, which is indicated using the built-in light in the product. But if you're expecting an Indian man to follow light signals, as soon as it goes red, we'll make it, 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 shit, 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 fuck, damn it, damn it, damn it. Oh no, should have stopped. This might also change the way arranged marriages are fixed, right? When a boy goes up to the girl's parents, he would be like, I don't want to feel your loss of your loss. I will do every wish for her. I will do trust and thrust in it. Now, let's take a look at the name. The product is called Sex Fit. If you're having sex for fitness reasons, then your partner has become your personal trainer. I can just imagine the girl shouting, going like, all right, come on, boy, come on, you can do it. One more set, one more set. Come on, full power. 20 more, just 20 more. Okay, maybe 10. Okay, five. Come on, one more, man, come on. <laughs> so next time when you get caught by the cops while making out, and he goes, kya kar rahe You could be like, sir, cardio, kal leg day na, abhi karna <laughs> All right, we got a great show lined up. Don't go nowhere. He has been fabulous. Woo! And now, for no reason at all, Anarchy Judge. Get off! Get off! India is doing well in many things, such as, you know, putting pressure on your kids, fixing marriages, and becoming Sherlock Holmes as soon as we see new people. Now, judging people is in our blood, and it seems like we're very good at it. Like, whenever you see someone from Delhi, you're like, oh, dek, dek, dek. <laughs> Like, as soon as you see someone from Kolkata, you're like, dek, 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 dek. Paka leftist hai. Gangli bhi lefty hai. Leftist hai. Now we have so many characters who are amazing at jumping to conclusions. If there ever was a competition, I wonder who would win. Good evening ladies and gentlemen and welcome to India's favourite game show and national pastime. This is Jumping to Conclusions. 
And with us tonight is our first contestant. She wraps culture around herself and calls it a sari. A rock star in every home, her broken records play all over the country. Give it up for every Indian mother! <laughs> And now, contestant number two. With his 18,000 tweets and 19 followers, all the way from a click farm in Nagpur, give it up for the online troll! And it's best friends. Cook! And finally, our returning champion of the last 70 years, with his mustache soaked in chai bani, his belt of Thoda adjust karlo, and his lati charged with brutality, representing the Indian police force, it's Havaldar Singh! <laughs> And now let's see who's good at jumping to conclusions. Your first challenge is an 18 year old boy was supposed to be home from cricket practice at 8 p.m. It is now 8.05. Contestants, jump to conclusions. Spark me bethe, istobari karnam bhenke, chumma chati karra. Youth corrupted by SI propaganda. 23 artists, 4 likes. Correct answer. You win a follow back from the Prime Minister. Already have it. Now let's move on to the next round of jumping to conclusion. The next situation is a girl. Pregnant ho gayi hogi. Meri nandhi kali pregnant ho gayi hogi. Us ghat ya nitin ki vajay se. अरे मैडम ऐसे कपड़े पहनेंगे तो ऐसा ही होगा ना। Feminism, feminism going out of hand. Feminazi, femi fascist, femi paradox, femi na Miss India. Same thing से गोरी गोरी। Contestants please, don't judge a girl just because she's a girl. At least hear what the bitch has done first. I agree with this ho. Now the full situation is. A girl has uploaded a status on her Facebook. That reads, Why always me? Sad, smiley, cry, smiley, sad, smiley, cry, smiley. Now, contestants, jump to conclusions. Betrayed in love jihad, but mainstream media never show this. Phir se hai mein skandal ke madam ka. Hostel mein reh rahi hogi bichari. Ghar ka khana miss kar rahi hogi bichari. Compassion detected. Compassion. No, 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 Chi. Uh, uh, uh. That was a positive judgment coming from a place of compassion. That has no place in my show. I'm sorry, madam. You are disqualified. Shame. Shame. Puppy. Shame. All. The donkeys. No. Your name. Contestants, I will give you one situation and you must base all your judgments around it. The final person standing will be the winner. Your situation is a couple in their 20s are in a living relationship. Living relationship? Mala shadi se pehle sex! Cheap! Soldier is standing on border, but liberal couple having sex in AC. RT if you agree, like if you are anti national. Rave party! Matlab, more weed karte hai, aise. Wrong! They do beef like this. Roar back my tattoo. She done that. Ears and piercing. Ears and piercing. I pill for breakfast. Homosex agenda. Divorce. Fifty percent of American couple divorce. Fact detected. Fact detected. Fact detected. Manish underscore six eighty seven. Did you just use a fact while jumping to conclusions? No, what, what, what I meant was 100% of Western culture destroy 100% of Indian youth. And why are you so RTI for this? Delete! Delete! You delete. can't delete that because you've been screenshot! Ah. Using my own tactic against me! This is why right wing account never get verified! And with that, the online troll has been eliminated. Our winner and 
still the reigning champion of jumping to conclusion is Hawal Dan Singh of the Indian Police Force. Well done, Hawal Dan Singh. And here is your prize. क्या मजाक समझाइए हजार का नोट भाई क्या है भाई तेरी परमिशन छूट के सो द नेक्स्ट टाइम इफ यू सी अ ट्रोल ऑनलाइन और इफ योर फ्रेंड इज अ ट्रोल स्क्रीनशॉट द इमेज दैट वी गोन बी पुटिंग अप इन फॉर द नेक्स्ट फ्यू सेकंड्स एंड मेक शॉर यू यूज दिस एज अ पोस्ट एंड टैग दैट फ्रेंड ऑफ योर्स हु इज अ ट्रोल नाउ डू दिस फॉर योर कंट्री एंड फॉर योर इंटरनेट two extremely talented guests for you tonight our first guest is a lyricist a comedian a screenwriter and a national film award winner you seen our second guest displaying her amazing acting abilities in landmark movies such as masan gangs of wasepur oi lucky lucky oi and many more ladies and gentlemen make some noise for varun grover and richard chadda Thank you so much, Thank you so much, Richa, for coming to the show. Let's start off with you. You're a Delhi girl. Yeah, I was from many places, and now I'm in Bombay. I've been here almost ten years. So now, have you become a Bombay person? I guess so. I think in the initial years, it was very difficult because everything was like east west and aloo and batata. <laughs> and uh, something very funny happened to me when I first came to Bombay. I was in Safiya College in a hostel. Mm -hmm. So I said, "Where can I get good North Indian food?" So someone said, uh, "Are we allowed to say?" Yeah. yeah. Okay. So Shiv Sagar. So I went to Shiv Sagar. I said, "It's okay. Shiv Sagar isn't going to sponsor this any day, so <laughs> you can say it. No competitor of Shiv Sagar is coming on this show." So and I said, "Give me dal makhani." Uh, so whoever is from Delhi knows that dal makhani can never be yellow. You know, it's the yes. black dal. Yep. It's a sacred thing. So he gave me yellow dal with butter. So I said, "No, no, ye nahi, ye nahi. Uh, kali dal." Then he got me masoor ki dal, <laughs> which is also a big problem if you're a North Indian. If if you're following, you can't have masoor ki dal pe butter and call it dal makhani. <laughs> so I said, "Bhaiya, ma ki dal, ma ki dal." He's like, "Hey, gali kisko deta hai? Kisko nikalo hai?" For me, that was like, okay, there is a, there is a. I think Varun will agree. Oh, Big. I have just one small trivia about Shiv Sagar. Okay, yeah. Shiv Sagar Church Gate wala jo hai. Uska uh. menu you open the menu. There's a there's a dish called in the vegetarian mains. Mm. They have only vegetarian mains actually. But the dish is called <laughs> veg tejaswini, and the next dish is called veg kolapuri. <laughs> Uh, it's a very niche joke, but <laughs> one particular family will get it. Okay. So, but I, somebody <laughs> clap there. Yeah, somebody. Yeah, What Tejaswini, is the joke? I didn't get it. Tejaswini Kolapuri is an actress. Yes, okay, yes, so yes. why veg Tejaswini veg Kolapuri <laughs> is just oh. it's like veg win and veg diesel. <laughs> that kind of thing. Oh, you really had to dumb down that joke for me. <laughs> You uh, <laughs> you were born and raised with uh, brothers who you used to bully. Yeah, two. Yeah. I used to bully two of them. Yeah, we actually have an image of. No. No. Yes. Ah, oh, there you go. <laughs> well, do you recognize who is who? Can you introduce us? Yeah, yeah. The, the one who's standing is you, right? That's probably my first item song performance. <laughs> and do you realize that no one is looking at me? <laughs> This is in the middle of the dance. Which song? I don't know. I think dhak dhak karne laga. Hey, the dhak dhak karne laga step is this one, no? Like. Yeah. My cat does it very well. Yeah. <laughs> Your cat's yeah. names are uh, Janiman and Dilber. Yeah, my yeah my love, it's it's ingrained in you. I have a cat called Kamli, and she will be offended if I don't mention. Yeah, and we just kind of did a match making of our cat. Oh no! Probably we'll. Ab apni dosti ko rishtedari mein badalne ka. 
unlike you who used to literally intentionally get into trouble, Varun used to get unintentionally into trouble. I don't know. Part of it was intentional, <laughs> but uh, but yeah. So that that story about that lovely umbrella. So this was in Dehradun. I was probably nine years old, ten years old. Okay. Kabi baris shuru nii hui thi, but my mom gave me this new umbrella, blue umbrella, kind of very nice. और वो मेरे से पहले दिन में ही खो गया स्कूल में बट मेरे पास हिम्मत नहीं थी ये बोलने की कि खो गया मैं छोड़ आया भूल गया सो आई केम होम एंड आई जस्ट सो आई वॉज अ वेरी गुड लायर ओके आई वॉज लाइक प्रॉब्ली द प्रॉब्ली अ बेटर लायर देन आर प्राइम मिनिस्टर सो बट अरे डॉट क्वी स्नाइपर हाँ इसका शो है भाई मैंने कुछ नहीं बोला है यू नो मैंने बोल दिया कोई सीनियर बच्चा आया और मेरे से छीन के ले गया इंटरवल में यू नो आई वॉज सो गुड एट दिस थिंग दे बिलीव मी माई पेरेंट्स दे वर लाइक अच्छा सच में हुआ एंड आई क्राइड एंड ऑल यू नो आई सेट कि नहीं ऐसा था वैसा था और मैंने बोला उसको नया छाता है और वट एवर उसने ले लिया अभी क्या करें माई मॉम एंड डैड लैंडेड एट द स्कूल नेक्स्ट डे विद द कंप्लेन टू द प्रिंसिपल कि ऐसा कैसा स्कूल है आपका और ये ना छाता ले गया आप बच्चे से और छोटा बच्चा है मोटा था छोटा नहीं था थर्ड क्लास में था सो इट वॉज लाइक यू नो इतने सारे सीनियर क्लासेज हैं प्रिंसिपल लास्ट में कौन सा छाता था कैसा था चलो साथ में ढूंढते हैं लाइक ये मेरे पास नहीं था छाता ढूंढते हैं देन ही टुक मी टू एवरी क्लास इन द स्कूल टू आइडेंटिफाई द क्रिमिनल हर क्लास में जाके मैं ऐसे वो सारे बच्चों को लाइन में खड़ा करके मैं शिनाख्त कर रहा हूँ और सब सोच रहे हैं कि हो क्या रहा है क्या है या एंड अल्टीमेटली आई केम टू दैट पॉइंट कि जब लास्ट की दो क्लासेस बची मुझे लगा अब मेरा झूठ पकड़ा जाएगा ये बोलेंगे कुछ नहीं मिला तुझे आई आइडेंटिफाइड वन बग नो आई सेड ये एंड ही वॉज लाइक क्या कौन मैं क्या क्या किया मैंने लाइफ में उसको पकड़ लिया और प्रिंसिपल ने वहीं उसको क्योंकि वो थक चुका था डेढ़ घंटे से दो घंटे से हम हर क्लास में उसको चला फाइनली एक मिला चलो मारो इसको और इसके मम्मी पापा को खुश करो कि हमने किया एक्शन लिया स्कूल ने वो पिट गया बेचारा उसको पता भी नहीं है छाता कौन छाता ये कौन है I hope he's now he would know probably मतलब हो सकता है अगर वो इस समय ये देख रहा हो he would know कि एक बार उसको गलत चक, इस चक्कर में मार पड़ी थी हुई थी बट दे इज पार्ट टू ऑफ दैट स्टोरी विच इज सिक्स और एट मंथ्स लेटर इन द स्कूल असेंबली वो दिखाते थे ना कल किसी बच्चे का ये पेंसिल बॉक्स छूट गया है क्लास yeah. में किसका है ये ना दे शोड दैट अम्ब्रेला फ्रॉम द स्टोर रूम तो वो उस दिन छूटा होगा वो किसी ने स्टोर रूम में डाल दिया अभी वो दिखाया एंड द प्रिंसिपल बिकॉज इट वॉज सच अ बिग केस ही रिमेंबर्ड कि ये वाला कलर का था और ये वाले ब्रांड का था ये इसी हरामी का <laughs> उसने वहाँ देखा और उसने फिर मुझे देखा कि मेरे चेहरे पे जो हवाइयाँ उड़ रही हैं एंड ही कॉल मी आफ्टर द क्लास आफ्टर द असेंबली एंड सेट कि ये तेरा ही छाता है ना एंड आई स्टार्टेड क्राइंग बिकॉज दैट एंड दैट वॉज जेनुइन क्राइंग फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम इन दैट पर्टिकुलर ईयर एंड देन माई पेरेंट्स वो कॉल नेक्स्ट डे एंड उनको जलील किया गया और बताया गया कि ये देखो ऐसा है और फिर मेरी सब तरफ से जो दसों दिशाओं से पिटाई हुई यू यू स्टार्टिड इन सरदार पटेल स्कूल one of my really good friends was from sada patel and she told me that uh, <laughs> this is how you guys used to applaud this. oh yeah this yeah. this is sada patel applause But this is polite hands. applause this is like hilarious yeah, those are jazz hands <laughs> one is enough <laughs> yeah you yeah. prank called a teacher for a year or more we i i used to have this bunch of friends i if you're watching it kohu and neha and vedika they're all adults now one mm. is studying to become a teacher so Ooh. hello karma <laughs> um So we we had this particular English teacher who was quite funny. So we used to keep calling her, and I used to play her character huh. on the phone and pretending to know her. And the character was called Kanpur Wali Masi. So we used to call her and say really stupid things like "Jalai bhi tar na bol gaye tu" or something like that. You know, in a completely different voice and completely different accent, which no one would imagine would come from Sadar Patel ka koi. So where is the camera? I am really sorry if you are watching this. We were. children i would never do it now ever of course now to, you won't like now now there's also mobile pe caller id but <laughs> never mind now 
now now now i remember that you uh, you've always wanted to write films yeah and then finally when you wrote masan uh what, tell me what came first the character came first or you wanted richa to be in that part no so while i was writing me and meeraj uh, the director mm. so we knew right from the beginning before we even started writing that richa is going to be there in the film and once we came up with the character of devi so i knew okay this is richa so i wrote some things knowing that richa can pull it off and you know mm. so it was always there it was not like richa was the first choice after writing it she oh. was the first choice when we started writing. even the the day before you started shooting what was uh, the gangs of us supposed set like before that for me i really i i when i came to bombay i really wanted to work with anurag he just seemed like one of the like cool people of cinema to work with so he called me and he telling me you know this one has said no this one has said no this one has said no do you want to do it so i said <laughs> i said what he said this is the main lead of this film that i am doing it's a two part film i said why have they said no he said because you have to become older So I said, but everybody is becoming older, or I am specially <laughs> aging. So he said, everybody is becoming older because it shows the passage of time. So I said, हाँ, फिर मैं करती हूँ. And uh, when we went for the first day shoot, there was like, I had made my notes, hmm. character graph, breakdown point, show power of woman and all. I remember on the first day he was like, <laughs> they are not one again. <laughs> He tore them. He flung them in the air in front of everyone, and we were we were shooting in a small town called Obra uh, on the outskirts of Banaras, two hours from Banaras. My hotel nii tha, so we were staying in a government guest house. I was sharing the room with Anurag's sister Anubhuti. She was the AD on the film, the uh, the chief, and uh, yeah, so it was not a very glamorous start. Yeah. I got mocked a lot, but it was lots of fun because I I got pushed to the extreme because I had to start with playing like a twenty year old. Then go to playing somebody about 35. Hmm. At the, by the end of the day, back to being pregnant and being 18, and the end of the day, 50 year old. So it was a huge jump. Now, before we actually go, I have one last story to discuss with Varun. Varun, um, you went for a corporate show in which they didn't particularly treat you well. Uh, which show was that? The, what what had happened? Because there was a post that came after that, and everyone was like, "Yeah, Mirza did it." So a German consulate was doing some business thing, like, like some business meet hmm. of German consulate with Indian businessmen. Hmm. Now, first of all, corporate show me stand up comedy hmm. is, in my opinion, is like a pasta counter in a Punjabi shadi. Okay, <laughs> nobody gives a fuck <laughs> if if. If you are there, nobody gives a fuck. If you are not there, everybody gives a fuck. Ki pasta kider hai. <laughs> so you should go with zero expectations. I didn't know that. <laughs> One, two. They started getting offended because the Germans were laughing at the jokes which were directed at Indians. I am an Indian. I don't know about German. Ka me kya idiosyncrasy nikal ke uspe joke marunga. <laughs> And the Indians got offended because they thought that Germans are laughing at us, and you are making fun of their country. And they started shouting, "You don't have any respect for yourself." So I was taken off stage in like nine minutes or so. <laughs> How long were you supposed to perform? Eight minutes. Thirty-five 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 minutes. Thirty-five
आप कोने में आइए अच्छा ये थोड़े वियर्ड फैन हैं लेकिन ठीक है कोने में वो कोने में जाके दे स्टार्टेड लाइक एक के बाद एक वो ऐसा उन्होंने बना रखा था कि मैं इंडियन पकड़ूंगा मैं फीमेल की ये फीमेल्स के बारे में ऐसा कैसे बोला अच्छा इसके बारे में कैसा बोला वो सब ने अपने अपने एजेंडा था वो सारे एजेंडा एक साथ मेरे पे डाले एंड देन समबडी थ्रेटन मी विद एन एफ कि ऐसा कैसे बोलता है तू some joke about traffic or something i have a lot of that coming your way so, na fire yep <laughs> so the hi tanne hum dost logo ko bhi f i r e n d s spell karte hain ha so they filed a fire so no yeah. so they threatened me with an fir the event company which had booked me right. so they told me ki hum aapko paise nahi denge aapne hamare client ko itna zyada offend kar diya <laughs> so then i had to write a blog just stating these facts and uh, it kind of went viral because as yeah. you said so many comics yeah. related to it <laughs> and uh, yeah then the agency kind of next day they relented yeah they and give you the money though yeah yeah raat ko they were like ki hum dekh lenge tere ko tu to jail jayega all that next day because the post uh, blog post had got so many co- <laughs> comments and all and so they next day very politely yeah. called me as if last night's call did not happen yeah and gave me the money after showing me a presentation of their company ved to the aur fir uske baad ye check aur jao so i was like okay cool so yeah, that's all right it was an absolute pleasure having you guys here thank you so much for coming for the show uh do make sure you check out varun show aise taise democracy 2 which is actually touring right now yeah, um yeah. it was there in bombay it'll be in delhi it'll be all around the country and also richa in her next movie which is or devdas that's what's going to be coming huh? or nahi love sonia love sonia excuse me one second yeah. apish do your research you idiot <laughs> <laughs> and also richa for in her next movie which is love sonia love sonia <laughs> ladies and gentlemen once again give it up for varun grover and richa chadda and now for no reason at all the court of rock for us to play a game we like to call bowl of judgment yeah! now all three of us will be playing this this bowl has a mix of true stories from our lives and false stories not from our lives now after i'm done reading that both richa and varun have to try to convince me that the story is actually yours i can ask them additional questions to verify their claims and i can finally decide if the story belongs to richa or varun or if both of them are lying if i guess correctly i get 100 points if i guess incorrectly the player who tricked me gets 500 points so are you guys ready to play bowl of judgment chalo drum roll All right, why don't why don't you start first? Okay. All right. <clears throat> okay. When I was five years old, I saw my dad shave when he left for work. I tried shaving and ended up with a bleeding jaw line. Uh, Obviously, it was me. Look at my chin. No, it's because I was five and I I did it. My dad was leaving. He has a French beard. You know, you've met my father. Yeah. You, can, you, are this person. you know my father. Yeah, you but know, he was going for work. He was wearing a brown shirt, brown handbag, like those uh, briefcase at that time, and uh, and and pants and shoes. What, and he, what brand of razor it was? It was I don't know. It was silver, and it had a black handle. And after that, he used to put uh, fit curry. Fit curry, yeah, yeah, yeah. So you put fit curry after that? No, after I didn't. She... I put old spice. I started with the cheeks because that's what he was doing, and he used to do this. Okay. So I did all of that. Okay. Okay. You okay. Go, please. Uh, absolutely flawed. Uh, number one, just because you, you know his dad. You what? Tell your story. Okay, my side of the story. story. <laughs> Trashing her story. <laughs> I am being Twitter right now. Behaving like a politician. Okay, guys. Okay, 
Here's the truth, okay? It is actually about me because I was extremely obsessed with my dad shaving every in the every day in the morning. Because as a kid, I want to grow up. I want to be a man. So when my dad actually used to do the thing, I used my own dad shave, and I'll tell you which one it was. You remember the topaz one, which was like this, like this, like this. You take the blade out, dega. Uske na blade dalke, I used to roll it back in, but. I I know that my dad removes the blade. तो मैं हर टाइम ऐसे ऐसे करते रहता था. तो मेरे को कोई टेंशन नहीं थी. But one day my dad didn't do it. He actually left the blade inside. और मैंने ऐसे किया and scraped off half my burns. And literally यहाँ ऐसे ही जब आया तो मतलब अरे ये तो खून निकल रहा है. And then when I saw, it was me. Varun. In blood. Just because he knows the name of the brand. I'm just saying, guys. I mean, guys, come on. If no, somebody again, has a bad memory. No, okay. We are talking about five years old. Yeah. Five year olds here. But yeah. I think it is his story and not yours. Am I correct? That is absolute bullshit. No, it's not my story. Yes, yes. Is yes. it your story? Not even your story. Not even it's not my story. Oh. So it's nobody's it's story. It's a nobody's story. So at this point in time, you don't win any points. I get 500 points. For what? Because I convinced him yeah, that yeah. it's my Achha, story. Achha, this show is so many points. Take this show is his way of feeling better about himself. <laughs> अब तो रुको अब अब तो मैं ये जीत गए नेक्स्ट राउंड ओके राउंड नंबर टू यू ऑलरेडी हैव अट इन ये सब एडिट होने वाले आई वॉज हिट बाय अ कार इन दिलेवेंथ ग्रेड एंड आई गॉट ट्वेल्थ स्टेचेस Uh, how about uh, how do you know? Richa, you go first. No, how did you know? Did you read my blog? <laughs> Come on. Okay. All right. Okay. So convince me. Which car was it? I was going to my school, which is on like we know Sardar Patel Vidyalaya. It's on Lodi Road, so it's on uh, Ring Road. So I got out of my bus, which was PV15, and I was crossing the road because I found my friend uh, Munali on the other side, and I jumped. I said, "Hey, Munali!" But right then. <laughs> <laughs> a Maruti 800 came and hit me, and it was so painful. Then, then, and when I stop laughing, Abish, because when I lay there on the road, my shoe was on top of the Maruti. Oh, oh my, my God! My school shoe. And then I fainted, and then people picked me up and took me to AMS, which is also on Ring Road. Okay. So you know this is my story. Okay. Now I'm going to ask you a question, which I asked you here. How many stitches did you get? Twelve. Oh, no. Okay, you remember. Okay. So it was in Lodi Road, and how old were you? I was in the eleventh standard. <laughs> okay, convincing. Uh, Varun, uh, is this your story or not? Yes, it is. Totally. Okay. So tell me what had happened. The guy actually went to jail. <laughs> <laughs> there is where was it? a police record of this thing. Just so, stitches the car. Okay, oh wait, hold on. Where are your stitches? I can't show. You. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> where are your stitches? Yeah. This, you show, you show. The stitches were here on the. <laughs> Even he can't show you. Yeah. Now. <laughs> no, I am wearing chudi dar jeans pen. Came. So, I. It was right after the school, just like her. <laughs> बट <laughs> तो मैं बहुत हरामी था जैसा मैंने बोला <laughs> तो मेरा आर्मी बस से मैं वापस जाता था आर्मी बस में आ, हमारे स्कूल के बाजू में एक और स्कूल था मुझे लगा ये तो झूठ बोल रही है यार। <laughs> मुझे लगा तेरी स्टोरी होगी so so no, अच्छा, हाँ, <laughs> <Okay. laughs> right, yeah. hmm. hmm. in school A Komodo dragon mysteriously appeared in our school outside the chemistry lab. Okay. <laughs> Who is going first? Well, so, because so Komodo dragon is a kind of a monitor lizard. Okay, so bigger family is monitor lizard. You know monitor lizard, जो सबसे होशियार जो lizard होता है उसको monitor बना देते हैं. Monitor lizard एक होता है. इतना बड़ा मतलब वो 
जैसा तुम सोचो ड्रैगन का अगर मिनेचर फॉर्म कहाँ कहाँ पाया जाता तो है एशिया में पाया जाता है साउथ ईस्ट एशिया साउथ ईस्ट एशिया में नाउ द सरप्राइजिंग थिंग अबाउट दैट वॉज कि ये इंडिया में नहीं पाया जाता है तो भी हमारे स्कूल में आया <laughs> हमारे स्कूल हमारे मंडी डिस्ट्रिक्ट नहीं, 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 नहीं ये लखनऊ लखनऊ में केंद्रीय विद्यालय गोमती नगर में हमारे स्कूल में आया हम लोग स्कूल में केमिस्ट्री लैब के बाहर खड़े थे और हम लोग वही अपने जनरल जो भी बी कर रहे थे और अचानक से एक बच्चे ने बोला कि अरे छिपकली हमने पीछे मुड़ के छिपकली का बाप का बाप का बाप इट्स लाइक दिस बिग एंड वॉज अफरा तफरी इन द स्कूल उस समय हमको नहीं पता था बाद में मुझे बहुत बाद में पता चला कि वो पॉइजनस नहीं होता एज इन इट इट्स इट्स हर्बी वोर इट्स नॉट अ कार्नी वोर लाइक मी या वो उस समय नहीं पता था उस समय तो हम सब की जो फटी हम लोग जो भागे और वो जमाना वैसा नहीं था जो फोन वाला नहीं तो यहाँ पे फोटो भी दिखाते हैं हम लोग <laughs> कि मैंने ये वो कैमरा से खींचा सो दिस दिस का केम एंड द इंटायर स्कूल वाज इन टू माइंड्स लाइक इन बॉम्बे ना कि कुछ एक्सीडेंट हुआ है तो देखना भी है भागना भी है दोनों चीज सो वी वर लाइक कि देखें एक वन सिंग लाइफ टाइम थिंग रुक के देखें कि भाग जाए रैन अवे Yes. No, it's wrong. It happened to me. Father Agnes, I'll tell you. Father Agnes, uh, this is when I was in school. I didn't know what a Komodo dragon was. Okay. Now, but our school had a zoo. So we had bunnies, which I found out about that bunnies are bunnies. Bunnies. We had swans. We had ducks. We had a Komodo dragon. We had parrots, and we also had lovebirds. Now, all of this was around. For us, that Komodo dragon had basically escaped from there, and it was in our football ground. And that's when we saw the Komodo dragon. Now, because we knew the Komodo dragon. As yes. like, ये तो कोमोडो ड्रैगन है। We went closer to the कोमोडो ड्रैगन, unlike his life. Read the shit out. again. वो कहाँ पाया गया? पूछो इसे कहाँ पाया गया? Just ask. School में? नहीं. School के बाहर. नहीं. नहीं. School के अंदर. Chemistry lab के बाहर. Yes. There is a specific Wait. location. Are we both lying or is he telling the truth? He's telling the truth. You lost. Is he yes. telling? Are you telling the truth? Yes. It happened. Damn it. It actually nice happened. Try yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. So, uh, with the score of 600 and 500 and 100, we have the winner for tonight's ladies and gentlemen. It is none other than Richard Chanda. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Thank you. That brings us to the end of the episode. Don't forget to say I love you to your parents. And also subscribe. My name is Abhish Matthew. Give it up once again for Warren Grover and Richard Chadha. Thank you so much for watching. See you later.